table. Questions and comments? The Honourable Member for Shikutumi Le Fjord. Hello. Mr. Speaker, when I learned that this omnibus legislation from the Conservative government would provide maximum minimum sentences, which would be less uh, serious for people who rape children than people who uh, have marijuana plants, I was disgusted. There's a tendency to want to uh, to punish less harshly someone who rapes a child than people who have uh, marijuana plants. I want to understand. I want to ask the member how that can be. Parliamentary Secretary. Thank you very much, and I, I uh, thank my colleague for his question. Uh, he may possibly have misunderstood uh, some of the terms uh, of this legislation. For example, yesterday the Parliamentary Secretary uh, for the Minister of Justice articulated very clearly uh, the, the penalties for, not, it's not, we're not talking about growing marijuana plants, we're talking about trafficking marijuana, growing it per, for the sole purpose of trafficking. And there's going to be uh, additional pen penalties if you're trying to traffic to young people. Uh, and depending where this offender would be trafficking. So certainly we agree sex offenders, as we said, uh, should not be receiving uh, uh, any kind of record suspension. They certainly need to do the time and there needs to be minimum sentences for them. But we also believe uh, that anybody who wants to traffic, and as I said in my, in my speech as a parent, the issue of drugs is such a serious one with young people. And marijuana is a gateway drug. There's no question about it. So we have to get tough on those who are trying to traffic and trying to get our young people into drug activity. Thank you. Well, sir.